Honey. And I'm now going to go to the I'm going to make some corn soup. Not just any old corn. But not the Those are the corn, uh, what do you call them things anyways in English? It's called how many on the uh, store shelves. This, this is all frozen. But that's the kind of soup we're going to make today. Pork hocks. Ukushu kadesak. I think they're, uh, are they thigh or? I think they're thigh. Ukushu <laughs> bomesak. So that's what I'm going to boil first. First off, so. Put some uh, water in the pot. Just put some pepper in there. Just to season it while it's cooking. Meanwhile, zitaga. 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 Oh, sea salt. Not too much. Me watch my boy. Apta. Ukushkade and Sakwanjim knows what. This is a bit dead and it'll boil. Those pork hogs have to cook till they're nice nice and tender where the, the meat just falls right off the bone. So we'll let that boil and we'll come back. This corn is uh how many is all frozen so we're gonna just leave that open and it's it's pre-cooked. I mean half half cooked. Half cooked. <laughs> so we're just gonna leave it sitting here for a while and then we're gonna use uh besides that uh, the pork hocks, we're gonna use moose meat. My brother gave it to me. He moose hunts every uh, every year, and every time he goes hunting, he gets a moose. So he gave me this moose meat. So everything is going to be from the earth today. Moose, daven, and an abukush, and the pig. <laughs> so we'll come back while we'll cook this a little bit too. Thaw it out on the pan and cook it till it's real tender and. We'll chop it up and put in the soup along with the corn and probably put some tomatoes in there and some kidney beans. It'll be really good. I think it's boiling down so I gotta keep checking it. So let's check it. Oh yes, sure enough it's boiled down. So we gotta take it off the burner and add some more water in there. Otherwise the lupus sack will burn. <laughs> okay, where's your guava gun? Oh, maybe I could just take the pot over there. And then I put the stuff in here. I'll just add water. Because these things take a long time to cook. We want them real nice and tender. And they've already been cooking about an hour, eh? Probably. Mm -hmm. this one. Yeah. So, I'll turn it up a little bit more so it'll get boiling again. And once it boils, we'll turn it back down. We might have to do this a couple times, let it boil down. Because it's good to let it boil down too because it gives that flavor. Because it, it fries at the bottom a little bit and it gives it more flavor. So it wasn't a mistake. It's I burned it. For okay, purpose. I think it's really boiling hard now, so let's take a look. Oh yes, most definitely. So it's boiling hard. Now we're gonna turn it down so that it just simmers. There. We'll just let it cook. Hopefully within the next hour. These things take a long time to cook. These. The next step after it, the meat is. Just about done. Um, we're gonna take the, the pork hocks out of the water, and I already cut one up. Take this pork hocks out of there. They're pretty much done. What I'm gonna do next 
is I'm going to cut the meat off and pieces and if you look at the water that's in there the broth how nice and brown it is from when it uh when i when the water went cooked down we're the first fry, time we're gonna brown that moose meat because that'll give it more our soup a little bit more color also instead of just you know having water in there uh, maybe frozen about that much, maybe like two, two of those, uh, I don't want to call them pats of butter. See, boiling, nearly. Then you put the moose meat in there. <laughs> <laughs> the stove is clean. <laughs> The uh, pork hocks are boiling. Maybe at this time we could add a little bit because we want to make a full pot of soup, so we want to add some uh, water in there. So once it's brown, I put that water in there, and then I add all of this into next. We're gonna <laughs> next we're gonna do the potatoes, pinik soup so far that we have. Because they these take a little, these are the uh, this is the item that cooks takes a little bit longer to cook besides all the meat. Corn. Right in there, mm. still partly frozen, so mm. it'll not thaw out in there. Well, it looks like the soup is done, so I got myself a wobble gun. I'm gonna scoop it out, and let's take a look at it. And I said I was going to sing you a song about Dam Nabo. Om Dam Nabo, Om Dam Nabo, Ap Che Dam Nang Mem Dam Nabo, Ap Che Dam Nang Mem Dam Nabo, Ap Che Dam Nang Mem Dam Nabo. Om Dam Nabo, Om Dam Nabo, Ap Che Dam Nabo, Good Dam Nabo. How about that, eh? <laughs> we're going to turn it off and we're ready to eat. Okay? Oh, and then, oh, no, oh yeah. I forgot to tell you too that I do sing songs in Ojibwe. And if anybody wants to order our songs, we sing songs like. CCR, Bad Moon Rising, these boots are made for walking, Elijah, many, many more. We have three CDs up. You'll see the uh, email on this video if you want to order. So I'll be hearing from all of you that view. Miigwech. <laughs>